No, I never watched Cena. That was Buffy. I can only have one strong female protagonist, you know? No. Okay. Are Xena and China the same person? Oh, uh, Gabrielle. When I think of Xena, you have to think of Gabrielle, her friend. Uh, the lesser than Xena. Um, I don't know why you're asking me if I'm versatile, when you should be asking Xena if she's versatile, because Xena is most definitely a top. <laughs> okay, have you seen those arms? Jealous. But then she was like trying to be with Hercules. I'm like, that's too much muscle. Yeah, I did. Big, strong lady with great, solid bangs. But like, she had a good combination of like, necessary and unnecessary armor. Like, usually when you've got a female superhero and they're wearing armor, it's just like, why? How does that protect you in any way? It's it's covering like your vagina and like your right nipple. Zena is, you know, this leather clad daddy who just needs a little girl. I mean, she was definitely one of the the strongest, biggest, tallest, most naked lesbians on TV. Right, the original, the original lady, the one who could, you know, the only woman who could be named after with an X in her name. I mean, who else could do that? But it was like they were just so cute together. Zena was a total top, and Gab was just such a little pillow queen who's like, oh, yeah, you're so weird. Um, I think Zena is has a place in like the Hall of Fame for lesbians, and I like that actress. She's hot. She was yeah one of the first girl kissing girls on TV. Oh, <laughs> I don't want to talk about my ex girlfriend. Oh, they were crazy. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> I don't have ex-girlfriends. If they all got in a room, they would say, if only her feet weren't so small, we could have shared shoes. Oh, I'm a terrible at communicating, whatever that's supposed to mean. Um, well, you always think of like the first and the latest, I think when you say ex-girlfriend. I think like, um, there's a lot of women that I've dated, but like I've never called my girlfriend but somehow they've ended up being like an ex-girlfriend. I don't know if that makes sense. But I'm just too sensitive and kind um, that I was a catch and they can't believe they let me go. <laughs> what do you think they're gonna say? My ex-girlfriends are good looking. My father pointed out the other day that I like beauty to the point that it is a fault and suggested I try dating bigger women like he has. Fazia likes to laugh with her head thrown back and um, she loves uh, cumin. She loves toasted cumin. It's not even a metaphor, sadly. <laughs> well, I mean, I can't say that without, I, I like to be modest, you know, so I can't, I can't mention the one awesome thing um, about me that, that everyone would, would say is a common denominator. Um, although I've recently had a bunch of ex-girlfriends add me on LinkedIn, so I guess they think I'm some sort of professional person, which is nice. I don't know. I don't know. My ex-girlfriends, I feel like I always really want to have friendships with them. But sometimes you just can't. That, and I can never get my mind around it. Like, why do you want to be friends with me? 